here we go. You're watching Suck Professor. Hello, everybody. It's me, Hank, and... Uh, James. James, James, this is a, a special conversation that you and I are about to have about uh, technology coming up. You guys are playing multiplayer on Suck Professor. Hit, oh, turn back. Okay, sorry. This is my first time on the map. Um, so we're talking about the Zem 3. Four. Four. This is a device that enables people to use a keyboard and mouse. Ah, oh, I almost got him. Use a keyboard and mouse. Let's see if I can. This shot will work. Will it land? Will it get him? There it goes. Nope. Went too far. It enables players to use a keyboard and mouse on console games. Right. Show and us how this came up. Uh, well, I'm just bringing people up to what the technology yeah. is that we're okay. talking about in case they're not familiar with the idea. That's it, though. And it gives someone a major advantage over someone using a controller and first person shooters. Right. Now, put a, give us some backstory on how it came up. Okay. So. I'm a PC gamer. Would you categorize yourself as a PC gamer? Yes, first and foremost, but yes. So any type of FPS over the years, be it Doom, Wolfenstein, Doom 2, Doom 3, Wolfenstein 2, there's only two Legis FPSs. Yeah. Just, Legion Shoot Larry, of Le course. Legion Shoot Larry FPS was We've amazing. We've been playing them with a mouse and keyboard because it's the most precise. Yeah. And because it was the only thing that was available back then. Yeah, yeah. You didn't have easy, so, easy Logitech right. controllers to... So yeah. when we get to the console gaming where we restricted to a controller with thumbsticks, analog sticks. Uh -huh. And it's a little bit frustrating because it's not quite as precise. Even with a lot of practice, it's not quite as precise as a mouse and keyboard. Right. It's definitely an inferior choice. Some people argue that it's not, that they're used to it, but... You can get used to Halo. Like, yeah. you can get used to older... Uh, not older, but, the, you know, you can play some of these console first-person shooters. GoldenEye is probably people's original like kind of like yeah. breaks uh, cut your teeth on first person shooter but they also have built into those games auto assist or aiming assist and things that that help that help you you don't yeah. get that with a keyboard or you yeah. shouldn't and it's like people who say well i can eat with chopsticks really easily a, a fork isn't any better a fork is better <laughs> chopsticks are impossible true they're freaking impossible unless it comes to smacking flies against the window yeah, like yeah. Anytime, people always say that to me and it's like okay well let's have a rice eating competition right you lose every freaking time yeah okay so those are the, the chopsticks okay. people the controller people the fork people are the most especially people. in first person shooters okay so basically so i've been playing the destiny beta for a while by the way i just want to point out how excited you are james and how much it's how nice it is to hear some passion in your I voice I, yeah okay go keep going so i've been playing it a lot and it's very frustrating because a lot of times you want to hit something, you can't because your thumbs will push the reticle a little bit too far to the left. You yeah. You move to the right, you go too far to the right. It's just... Oh, man. Nice, nice. Did I get him? You got him. Oh, fuck yeah. So, it, Speaking of reticules, yeah. so I got a reticule. Yeah, so you're proving me wrong as I say this. That, no, no, no. Uh, <laughs> that's not true at all. But it's, it's frustrating for me. So I was thinking... We're on the, the current generation consoles. Yeah, P we're playing, playing on a PS4 right now. Right. These things are as close to computers as consoles have ever been. Yeah. So it only feels natural that there would be native keyboard mouse support. So you can play with- Oh the God, I saw them too. Yeah, it's, it's very frustrating. All right, native keyboard mouse support right. with, turn, yeah, with it these- Yeah, turns out it doesn't have it. And I was thinking to myself, why not? This is an FPS game. You would think that people would have the choice of which one to use. Right. So I looked up an article and Bungie was saying, Bungie's the maker of Halo, maker of Destiny, mm -hmm. that people don't play FPSs with keyboards and mice anymore, and that Halo fundamentally oh, I changed that guy. the way games are played, which I call bullcrap on. Yeah, that's bullshit. That's completely garbage. I mean, a lot of people play FPSs with controllers, and they should, because it's still really fun. Yeah. But it's not as precise and it's not as good, and you don't have as right. much control as you do when you're playing with a keyboard and mouse. Right. So it's pretty absurd that they would say that, that uh, people don't play in keyboard and mouse before you could make a case that m m more gaming happens um on consoles i don't know if that's true or not but i think that's probably true i know pc gaming is a little bit less than than uh, regular gaming but yeah that's that's crazy right. so anyway that think? pissed you off though you're like fuck that yeah that's complete bull crap but yeah. here, here's the thing that i i understand this is i'm going to go against what i really think and oh, play devil's advocate for a second people play console games because they want to play on a level playing field. You play a PC game, some guy's gonna have a better processor, more RAM, better video card, he's gonna move a little bit better, his frame rate's gonna be a little bit better, his connection oh, is gonna damn. be a little bit better. You know, there's all these different variables when you're playing on a PC platform that affords players different levels of advantage based on their setup and, yeah, and what they're doing. Yeah, a higher ping, or lower ping. Uh, yeah, you know, I mean, yeah. connection's really a bad example because even on consoles, that's still a variable. But Good point. on consoles, everyone's got the same hardware. Everyone's got the same controller. Everyone's playing on equal footing. 
And that's what a lot of people appreciate and a lot of people like. On the flip Don't side... Neutralized. Oh shit, god damn it. Yeah. I, I'm just advertising myself. Yeah, Alright, go ahead. No, I, ah! I've been kind of scouring the internet trying to find some place where a Microsoft representative or Sony representative would say, we don't care if you use mouse or keyboard. Because uh, to you, wait, hold on. You, I thought you, Bungie said that. Well, no, uh, I found something where Microsoft said it. Oh, you did well, find it. Okay. Yeah, they, they basically said, we don't consider it cheating. We're okay with you doing it. Just bear in mind that we're not going to support it. Okay. It's not officially supported. So if you have trouble with it... Now, were they saying that in response to the rising popularity of this device, the Zem 3 or Zem 4? No, or was it just sort of a older... Like, how recent was, well, was this, that? Well, this was somebody kind of, emailing support to Microsoft yeah. saying, are you going to ban me for using this? And they okay. basically said, we don't support it. It's not officially licensed by Microsoft. It's not condoned by us. Okay. But if it should mess up your system, your warranty is voided. You're it's on your own. It's not mess up anyone's system. It's just a Bluetooth connection. So yeah. they you there. Yeah. But they didn't specifically say, this is going to cause us to ban you. Right. On the flip side, there are devices that let you use keyboard and mice. And also, this also allows you to use any controller you want in any console. So you can use a PS4, a DualShock 4, or an Xbox One, and vice versa. Right. What, what does bother me is when people use like auto fire buttons, rapid fire buttons. To me, that is absolutely cheating. Pow! Hi, nice. <laughs> uh, by the that, way, the, that was awesome. take a pause to catch your breath, James. Yeah. You're, you're, I love, I love your passion. Yeah, I love that. And let's that. just appreciate that kill. Yeah, that was pretty good. That was fun. All right, so where, where were you? Okay, so, okay, so, so here, I, I'm, 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 I'm trying to keep up and concentrate on the okay. game. I'm, I'm only hearing about every other word you're All right, saying. I'll, I'll lay it out flat and simple yeah. right now. Please. My definition of cheating yeah. is when another player uses something be it an exploit in the software side or something unintentional in the hardware an extra, side. E either extra or or exploiting a, yeah, a, a loophole. Yeah, external to the intended playing field to gain an advantage over other players. Yeah. And under that definition, this would be cheating. But on the flip side... Because they're... Hold on. Because they're using something that not everybody has access to. Yes. Well, you could say everybody has access to buying it. Thing, but, they're, but they're not using it in the way it was intended right. to be played or designed for. On the flip yeah. side, though... That's my definition. This is I'm not the one who makes the rules this. This is Bungie, Microsoft, Sony who's making the rules here. And according to everything that I can find, they do not consider this to be a cheat. Yeah. And I, but I completely get how players who do the controller would think that this is dishonest and this is, you know, absolute exploitation. Well, I would be frustrated if I was playing with a with a, a controller and someone had a, P, a PC or a keyboard and mouse. Uh, yeah. You know, like if right now we're sitting next to each other and you got a controller, I got a PC and mouse. I got a huge advantage. I can yeah. be faster. I can I aim quicker. I can shoot as faster. As as yeah. yeah, you don't stand a chance. You know, of course, in this game, you'd probably still kill me because no, no, I know. But, um, but so, so in your mind, is it cheating? Um, say it again. But, but, but is using it specifically in Destiny okay. beta cheating, or is that okay. in general cheating for all okay, FPSs? Let's say this. Microsoft and Sony say it's not cheating. But to you... Oh, fuck. Well, I threw my grenade. Okay, if you could push a button and say... It is... It, yes. Will be detected, oh, I killed the guy. I did get oh. a kill. Somehow, I think. Yeah, yeah it did. you did. You yeah. did. Monkey Poo 469 for the kill. Now, would you, so I'll, would you I, ban it? I wouldn't... Okay, that's a different question than is it cheating? Mm -hmm. I, I think it is cheating. I think it's it's hard to argue it's not, but um, I, I think I have a hard time. I don't know. I, I I feel like my thoughts were much more clear about this earlier when we were talking about it because because wow. what's going to happen nice. though? Yeah, that was nice. Hey, look, I'm actually getting better. What's going to happen is that if they can't stop it, they have to find a way to in to work it into the fold as far as how how it plays. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's one of those things, like, you can't stop illegal piracy. You can't mm -hmm. stop illegal downloading. You can combat it. You can make it horrible. Or you can take it take it, and use that behavior and figure out a way to benefit. You know what I mean? Yeah. Does that make sense at all? Oh, I was hoping for a melee. Yeah, I'm trying to use my fire shotgun. So I'm not sure if I'm making any sense. I am. Oh, that's why I can't think straight, because I'm also trying to play this game. Yeah. Um, so you can't stop it. You can fold it into the... Mm. Oh, is that over? Yeah. Okay. We can keep talking, though. Um, we took a small break there mm -hmm. to load up the next level. We're almost going to start this next multiplayer. Mm -hmm. I was answering, can you, is it illegal? Or no, sorry, is it illegal? Is it cheating? Right. And I was saying, like, it's going to happen. 
if it's going to happen, they have to embrace it and fold it into their system somehow. What does that mean? I don't really know. I don't because. Okay, like casino, like how how could they tell? It's a Bluetooth thing. Like they're not going to be able to tell by technology. There's no signal that's going because mm -hmm. as far as anything knows, it's just a, a controller Control. being played. Right. Buttons are being pressed. Mm -hmm. Maybe well, they can tell like the way casinos are able to tell when someone's mm -hmm. cheating by the fact that they're winning more at rates that don't comport with normal behavior, normal studies. So like they could see like, oh, this guy's getting a lot of these really precise headshots. This guy's getting a lot of these really precise this and that. Therefore, it's likely that they're using it. But that's a really dangerous area to be in because now you're now you're, you're banning people. You're going to be pissing off people. So maybe the answer is to do keyboard mouse only. Maybe they figure out a way to detect it and that's reliable and maybe they can ask people to confirm and you um, you only get to play against other people who have that. That might be a, a, a way to go about it. Yeah. But yeah, I don't know. I mean, then you're always going to get those assholes who opt in to be like the keyboard mouse gas out guy right. through that door. And, and the thing that makes me think that they can't detect it or have no interest in detecting it is that the thing, the device is coming out in the next couple of days. By the time this is in, anywhere on the net, it's already out. Yeah. The Zim 4, and I might be pronouncing that wrong, it's XIM4. You can find it at XIM4.com. Okay. Different versions of this have been out forever, so people have been playing Halo on the Xbox 360 and that for ages using the Zim 3 and the mouse and the keyboard, and they, there's even entire teams, like Zim teams, that go out there playing and you know competitively like that. Right. I mean, but what are they doing? Are they out there? Um, what's the right word? Griefing? I mean, I don't know the right right term. Are they just out there destroying in, in public rooms? Much better because that's the controller that's most comfortable to them, just like it's most comfortable to me. Oh, come on, you that's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. I get him? Oh, assist? Yeah, you got him. I was very shitty. Well, that, that's my guy, isn't he? Let's just crouch down and hope he comes but around the corner. One thing I should mention is is that whenever tournaments come about for these games, Black Ops, uh, you know. Oh, I was hoping for a melee. Why do I think that? Yeah, well, anytime there's a tournament. Yeah. And people are together in a room, they ban the use of this because they consider it's not a fair yeah. level playing ground. Which yeah. Which I kind of get. And it's like playing cards with x-ray vision. It's like you gotta, you, you're, you're supposed to have what everybody else has. Right. Like that guy. He got a head, a bullet to the head because he killed me, mm -hmm. which he deserved. So go ahead. So what, what about people, I mean, I'll start with a story from a game I used to play a long time ago. There are a lot of people in this online game who are using these things called unattended combat macros. All right. Basically robots, they would park in popular leveling spots and just all day and night just grind and grind and grind. So hold on, like a bot that just shoots, a, a camping bot, basically. Yeah, it just ruins the game experience for everyone else because it's sucking up the entire hunting spot. They never get tired, <laughs> they never leave, they never go away. It's completely inconsiderate and rude. Can the servers suss those out and ban them? Well, they used to. What they do, they would send a, a manned sentinel or admin in after them, and they would yeah. ask them a series of questions. Oh. And this program was really smart because it, as soon as one would come around, it, they would be detected because they always had a plus sign in front of their name. Yeah. So that would trigger a text message to be sent to the phone to the person running the bot, and they'd and they sign could in. respond to the questions via their smartphone. Wow. So it was really sad. <laughs> but the justification for that... What were they getting out of it? Tons of loot, tons oh, of XP, okay. tons of, you know, all sorts of good stuff. Yeah, yeah. And they would often say, when you would catch them doing it, they would oh, fess right. up to it and say, well, yeah, I can do it because I've got carpal tunnel and I, this is the only way I can play the game. All right. But you're not really playing the game. So that, that's a complete... I don't want to get into that kind of thing because that's a completely different thing. But... A large group of the community that use keyboard and mouse for consoles have legitimate. Ah, oh, motherfucker! These are people that have. So wait a minute. So, so, one thing that you have known and that you read and you're recent looking into the, this thing is that people out there who have motor. Yes. Cerebral motion, palsy, cerebral palsy, motor sclerosis. coordination things. Right. A they have a hard time with a controller because yeah, a controller it takes is, your is, thumbs, your fingers. Yeah, as bad as it is for us, it's ten times worse for them. Did I get him? I don't know where he is. Yeah, he kind of disappeared. I'm alive. Zone C lost. Yeah, so it's... I, I forget which one is the grenade. Enemy captured zone C. Oh, that was crazy. Yes, yeah, so, so would you say it's okay for them to use a keyboard and mouse? Yeah. Why is it okay for someone in a wheelchair to use a ramp when they don't when there's stairs? Right. Because okay. it's okay, because it, 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 we, we live in a society, society that it's that there's nothing wrong with someone, that there's more wrong with excluding somebody who has some sort of condition or illness than with giving them a slight advantage in doing it. Okay. However, they're starting from a, mm -hmm. a lower point where they ha need need help. Right. I'm so, not I mean, that, the, the word in golf right. is handicapped. Right, I'm not saying that because <laughs> it's okay for them, it's okay for us. Right. 
I'm just saying that secure. how would you feel about a person in that kind of a situation being banned for using that kind of technology? A person with uh, a debilitating with, motor skill. Yeah, I addition. would feel that's pretty shitty. I think that's a horrible that that crime is worse than letting people cheat. Right. So if that were to happen, would that not be evidence? Oh, I thought I had him. Oh, I did get him. Did, My grenade got him. Yeah. <laughs> I just threw in there. <laughs> would that not? Did you kill everyone? Grenade probably. But would that not be an argument for Bungie? Say or it Sony again. Or Say whatever? start it over. With your late, their if latest people argument. People using it for that ability, or for that, you know. Yeah. Oh, reason, people that need it. Yeah, yeah. Then there's no way to tell who's using it for that reason and who's not. So well, how right. Can you then ban people. It op Yeah, exactly. How can you ban people? It right. opens up the. Um, well, it just makes what are they gonna do? Send out the police right. to go investigate someone's motor coordination thing? Okay. And here's the other thing. This is the main thing for me that makes me think that I can go ahead and give this thing a try. Uh huh. This is not a hidden device. This is not something that some guy's making out of his garage and selling on the down low forums and so forth. This is a commercial product. It's available commercially on Amazon, eBay. Look, he doesn't know where I am. <laughs> It's all over the place. <laughs> uh, where's my grenade? Oh, it okay, so it's commercially available. It is, it is widely it. dispersed. Yeah. Anyone can use it. Yeah. So if you're still using a controller, when the controller is not the most comfortable and efficient way of playing a game, is that not then your fault? Well, what if you can't afford the keyboard and mouse thing, and that's not the way the game is designed and made, though? I mean, I think well, there's I there's something to be said. For... Does that mean people who drive Ferraris or no, you know? no? But you shouldn't be. You're not excluded from driving because you can only well, afford a ter a Tercel that they, that, that runs with your feet. Places faster than I am just because I can't afford a Ferrari. Yes. Yeah. Well, they have to follow the speed limits, though. No. Well, they don't. In fact, they get pulled over. Well, I know they don't. But I'm just yeah, saying, like, that's a form of yeah. cheating too. Yeah, you made a very good point. You're not following the rules, and. I agree with you, though. I don't know if we're even disagreeing. I think it's an interesting conversation. And what I said earlier, too, was more and more keyboards are in people's living rooms. People yeah. are pe people's televisions are becoming co our computers. Yeah, They're, I got a what? Uh, point one. <laughs> people's televisions are computers. People's mm -hmm. computers are connected to their televisions. The line is being blurred every day. So I think that they need to embrace keyboard mouse compatibility with mm -hmm. all of these things. I just right. don't actually look forward to how I'm putting it on the coffee table. That yeah. just seems awkward to me. I'm yeah. sure you, you can get used to that or just maybe put the coffee table on your lap. Yeah. So the question we want to ask people is, do you think it's cheating? Yeah. If you had it, would you try it? If other people were using it, would you feel different about trying it? And should it be banned? Yeah. Should it be banned? So what's going to happen? Let's do some predictions. I think we'll get no comments. No, no, no not on our channel. Our channel is small. By the way, if you're uh, listening, please subscribe. We're, we're, we're a growing uh, video game channel. James and I have been playing games forever, mm -hmm. and um, I've been swearing forever. So please <laughs> subscribe. So what's going to happen, though? I mean, what I'm saying is with this thing history. being released and in the context of Destiny Player. Okay. Because this is a good example of a, of a next-gen game. Right. Okay, there's multiple different devices. There's the Cronus Max. There's the Venomex. There's the Zen 4. Virtua Boy. Yeah, yeah, Virtua Boy. There's different devices that serve roughly the same purpose, allowing you to use different controllers on consoles, mm -hmm. allowing you to use keyboards and mice on consoles. The difference between the Zen 4 and the rest of them is that the Zen 4 is by far the most technologically advanced one, but most importantly, it doesn't have rapid fire capabilities. It doesn't have all the things that people typically associate with cheating, which I agree with them. Okay. You can go on eBay on Amazon and buy modded controllers for the Xbox 360 and so forth. That do auto shooting yes. or... To me, that is absolutely yeah. undeniably cheating. Yes. This That's, is just changing the control scheme. This is, yeah, exactly. This is just changing how you interact with the interface of the yeah. game. That's it. Yeah. You don't fire any faster than anyone else. You don't have advantages to, you know, I guess you could hold down a button, but I don't think that would I don't change know. things. Then that shift lock thing kicks in. and yeah, all the and sticky keys. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sticky keys. Uh, yeah, they, so what do you think is going to happen? Are, is, are people going to be pissed about this? Will the games well, just have to adapt or players? It's been going on forever. I mean, it's already out there. Yeah, it's been out there forever. Yeah. And I think it's just now becoming a topic that okay. I'm hearing about because it's just about to hit on the new consoles. Interesting. Mm -hmm. We nailed it. Everybody, uh, let us know what you think in the comments. Hit the subscribe button and come back and watch all of our other videos. All right? Thanks. Bye, Alrighty. James. Goodbye. Did you cover everything? I think so. All right. Well, oh, you're dead. Oh, damn it. Oh,